ladies and gentlemen, my name is Wes Silvestri, and on today's video, I'm out here in beautiful Studio City to show you this brand new $9 million luxury home. Let's go see. to commend the developer on this one because they went all out. They cut no corners, they spared no expense. From the three car garage with these beautiful glass panel doors to the second story of the home with the black shiplap paneling with this cut stone exterior, they went with the top of the line everything. This home is gonna feature five bedrooms, five bathrooms, and over 8,600 square feet of living space. And that is not including the guest house in the back. Now let's start right here at the front door. Now, if you're building new construction in California, you have to get yourself a pivot door. That just screams luxury. What kind of door? Pivot. 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 Shut up. Shut up. Shut up! It's like $20,000 just for the door. As we enter the home, right off the front door is this little seated area, or as I like to call it, the room that nobody ever goes in. Obviously, there's a spectacular amount of windows letting in ample amount of natural light. You also have this gorgeous marble fireplace, which is just exquisite. <laughs> now let's head over into the formal dining area, which this is just, this is just too much. The beautiful thing about this formal dining area is once you're done with your meal, you just step right outside where you can sip on your nice little lemon cello or maybe finish off a nice glass of brandy. Let's head into my favorite part of any home, the kitchen. And this kitchen is just on a whole nother level. Why? Because it's got not one, but two islands, two islands, get out of here. Not only that, it's got a hidden fridge. Did you even know a fridge was here? No, you didn't. Now, I love the fact that they kept the, the light floors. They went with the light cabinets, but they also went with a two-tone. Notice, you got the light oak bottom cabinets with the gold poles, and then you have the white cabinets up top. Not only is this a chef's kitchen, but you can turn into a barista. Why? Because you got your own espresso maker right here. And of course, a home of this magnitude is obviously gonna have its own butler's pantry. You think for $9 million you could get a wall. I'm kidding, this is a glass sliding door completely tucked away and hidden opening up your house from the outside to the inside to the inside to the outside. This door is insanely heavy, but if you notice, just one finger, ooh, fancy. This backyard is California living at its finest. From the pool, the barbecue area to the basketball court. Now here's the deal. If I make this shot, you have to subscribe to the channel. Bucket. Take that Steph Curry. Now because I made it, you have to subscribe to the channel. The property is sitting on over 15,000 square feet. Most homes in the area are anywhere between seven and maybe 9,000 square feet. But the use of space here is just magnificent. 
Now you might be asking yourself, Wes, does this $9 million home have its own movie theater? Well, of course it has its own movie theater. With a screen that's over 100 inches, you can clearly watch the game, watch the newest Netflix release. This might be the best spot to just Netflix and chill. Downstairs, tucked in its own wing of the house, is this downstairs bedroom also leading out to the backyard with its own walk-in closet. And of course, it's got its own ensuite bathroom. Now let's head upstairs, but first, stop and admire this chandelier because it's absolutely gorgeous. Let's first head into the primary bedroom. Why? Because it's breathtaking. From the fireplace to the oversized deck. And don't forget about these custom built-ins. But the thing that I love most about this primary bedroom has got to be this closet. I mean, because there's, there's this closet, which is beautiful. Then you go around the corner to this closet. I mean, this is flat out jaw dropping. This primary bathroom just exudes luxury. Obviously it's gonna have the dual vanities. Obviously it's gonna have the additional storage. Obviously it's gonna have a tub that's just big enough to, well, big enough to fit me. But I love the fact that they carry this dark herringbone pattern on the floor right on into the shower pan. It just is wow, beautiful. And look at that. They even have a rain shower head. Kudos, developer. Kudos. Now let's head over and see the additional three bedrooms. is every single one of these bedrooms does come with its own bathroom. Let's talk wine. Now here's the deal, I don't even drink wine, but I love a featured wine wall. Let's go take a look at the guest house. Now what I love is they've carried the same design from the main house out here into the guest house. Notice that same European light oak flooring, those flat cabinets, black marble fireplace, and this bedroom. Could you imagine having your friends or your in-laws come over and they wake up to this view? And of course, guest house has its own bathroom as well. have to admit that house is simply a masterpiece and if you want to come take a tour for yourself I need you to contact me today shoot me an email let's get you out here as soon as possible but as always thank you so much for watching today's video don't forget to hit the like button don't forget to subscribe to the channel and I will see you next time goodbye